back to my channel. My name is Laura, and today I'm pre-recording Top 5 Wednesday, and the topic this week is favorite books um, that are out of your comfort zone. So I looked at all, I went to my Goodreads, I read 276 books in my Goodreads, and I sorted it by my five stars, and then I went down and I was like trying to think of which ones are out of my comfort zone. So I came up with five books. So this is what I came up with. Okay, so the first book, sorry. <laughs> the first book I came up with is a YA book. Um, it's a book that I only read book one of the series and I want to read book two. Um, it is called Unwind. I'll put the picture here. Um, it is about a... Um, it's about teenagers, and when they become uh, at age, I think 13, uh, their parents can send them to the government, and the government can unwind them, which means they can take them apart and take their body parts and change their body parts and give it to other people, and it's really disturbing. Um, I went into this book blindly. They told me to read this book, and I was like, oh my god, what the hell am I reading? Um, I really, really enjoyed it. I gave it five stars. It did keep my attention. Um, I do want to read the next book. And I actually have my, oh, I have it here, but it's underneath everything. So I'm not going to pull it out. I have Unholy sitting over there. So anyway, I want to read it. Um, I want to continue the series. But, but I read this like two years ago. And I have to figure out, um, find a... Um, a summary of it because I don't remember much of it but <laughs> so uh, but it was a very good book uh, very disturbing and it was out of my comfort zone okay so the second book uh, that I had is an adult book it's adult content um, it is called adultery and I'll put the picture here um, I listened to this on audio and I felt like the audio was like talking to me um, it, it was really, really good, um, but there is sexual content in it. Um, I do not approve of adultery. Um, my sister is going through something right now, and I don't approve of what my brother-in-law did and is still doing. I just don't approve of that. So, uh, yeah. So this is kind of out of my comfort zone. So, But the book was really good. I liked his writing style, um, but again, it's adult content. Um, just to let you know. <laughs> okay, number three, coming in at number three. Number three is a whole series that I only read the first three books, and I really enjoyed it. I listened to this one on audio. It's the Selection series. I'll put this picture here. Um, now, I don't watch TV, so I do not watch The Bachelor on TV. So this is out of my comfort zone because... Um, those TV shows are not in my comfort zone. I don't like re watching real life TV shows. So, um, about uh, real life. So, and the guy is a bachelor. He has all these women and he has to date all these different women at the same time. I don't approve of that at all. Uh, so, uh, yes. Yeah, so, but the selection series was really good. I really enjoyed the all the three books that I read so far. So, that's the third one. Okay, coming in at number four is a graphic novel, and it is called Chew, and I'll put the picture here, and I've, I've talked about this uh, one a couple of times on my channel. Um, it's about a police detective who has this ability, to, when he eats things, he could see where things came from, and it's really, really graphic and really gross at times, like he eats things like body parts and... Uh, really gross stuff. My husband's like, you don't even watch horror films. How can you read that? But I, <laughs> I am. I'm reading it and I'm enjoying it. And I'm already up to book six or something. So yeah. So uh, that's that one. And the last book. Um, this was a real big stretch. The last book I picked was One Breath Away. I'll put the picture here. Um, this one is about a school shooting. So it is out of my comfort zone because I do work in a school. and But um, but that's the only one I could think of because all the other ones are really memory loss. I read a lot of that. I read a lot about the, about the Holocaust. Um, and um, I think that's it. So... 
anyway, so I hope you enjoyed this. This one was a hard topic to do, but um, I did it, and um, it's 11.30 at night. And anyway, thank you for watching, and I will see you in another video. Bye.